광야길을 가는데 성막과 망대가요 움직이는 거였어요. In walking in the wilderness, the tent of meeting, the tabernacle were moving. They were mobile. 그래서 에, 그 성막에는 바퀴가 달려 있어요. And that's why the tabernacle actually had wheels. 이것도 움직이는 거였어요. This too, the ark of the covenant rather was moving. 여기서 꼭 참고해야 되는 건 우리 허터진 제자들 또 실제 전도 나가는 분들은요. 우리는 이 언약이 움직여 전달되는 거란 말이죠. So as our disciples as well as our evangelists, you must always remember that the covenant and gospel we have is moving. 이 일이 일어날 때도요. Even when Joshua chapter 3 verse 1 to 13, these works are arising. 그래서 에, 여러분이 잘 보셔야 되는 거는 So what you must look carefully at 결국은 하나님의 언약은 변천하고 같아요. At the end of the day, God's covenant is unchanging. It's the same. So God said to Joshua, 모세를 잘 알기 때문에 모세와 함께 했던 것처럼 너와 함께 했다. Because he knew Moses well, he said, I will be with you just as I was with Moses. 그리고 이미 그 가난 땅을 이게 주었다. And he said, I have already given you the land of Canaan. He didn't say, I will give it to you. He says, I have given it to you. So be strong and courageous. Do not fear. God repeatedly says this. Simply said, he was equipped with the absolute partisans and the five authorities, and that is so important. He had equipped himself with the CVDIP in advance while he was with Moses for 40 years. Simply said, he already possessed and was enjoying the spiritual summit. So you're moving forward holding to this covenant. Especially for our scattered disciples, our evangelists that are evangelizing overseas, you must take this. So everyone that's leaving on missions today as well, you must take this with you. You'll be moving via flights. You need to have this as you are traveling. And so the reason why you need to balance between rest and prayer time is because sometimes you're praying to gain strength and sometimes you're praying in peace. Sometimes it's a time for you to just wait. So it's enjoying either way. Sometimes you're just enjoying. Sometimes it's a time for the kingdom of God to be established. Sometimes it's a time for the armies of angels are mobilized. So this is something tremendous. And if I... I'm in a misconception regarding this. The Bible is wrong. It's not a misconception. And you will see. This is what we call a spiritual summit. Joshua and Caleb possessed exactly this. And that's why the two of them that had this were those who were able to enter in. The rest of them, only the remnants entered in. But the people from Egypt that weren't equipped with this, they weren't allowed to go in and they didn't go in. And if they were to go in, they would have just been a disturbance and hindrance. So only Joshua and Caleb and the remnants were able to enter. And one person that they knew from them was Rahab. So how accurate is the word of God? So what is it that they were able to see? 출애굽기 23장 13절에서 16절을 본 사람이요. They were those who saw Exodus chapter 23 verse 13 to 16. 유월절이 뭐다? 본 they, 사람입니다. They were those who saw what the Passover was. 구원을 본 거죠. They saw salvation. 오순절이 뭐다? 본 겁니다. They had seen what the Pentecost was. 능력. They had seen power. 수장절이 뭐다? They knew what the ingathering was. They knew the background. They went forward enjoying this. And so even as you're traveling, enjoy the background of the throne of heaven, enjoy the background of the kingdom of God that you have. And then, 
성막 중심으로 장막이 쫙 만들어져. In the uh, as the Israelites were walking in the wilderness, how did they move? 장막 좀 사람이 살고 있는 집들이 성막 중심으로. They were moving, following the tabernacle and the tent of meetings, and so one was a resident, and the rest. 이 성막에 모이니까 회막이. The same thing, and then because they needed a place to get together, they had the tent of meeting, and so sometimes they would use the tents and the tent of meeting together, and sometimes they would place all of the tents and the tent of meetings towards the tabernacle, and they would also make a hut. 이렇게 이스라엘 민족들이 이게 이동되는 힘 가지고 간 거예요. So they went forward with the power that they possessed. 어떤 일이 벌어졌습니까? So then, what works took place? 이 지금 성막 있는 곳과 이 언약이 있는 곳에 어떤 일이 벌어졌습니까? So what took place where the covenant was, where the tabernacle was? 출애굽기 14장 1절에 13절입니다. Exodus chapter 14 verse 1 to 13. 이게 중요한 거 나와요. It says something very important. 뭐가 나왔냐면은 하나님이 미리 홍해 앞에 데려가서 홍해 건널 거라고 약속했어요. God took them before the Red Sea and tells them that they will cross it. 그러니까 모세가 확신하고 얘기합니다. And that's why Moses can say with assurance, "See the work of salvation God will do through you today." 하나님이 언약 시작할 때 약속 이 지팡이를 가지고 가르치니까요, 홍해 갈라지는 역사. And just as God promised when He pointed the staff, the Red Sea really split. 요수아 3장에는 중요한 말이 나오죠. And in Joshua chapter three, we see something very important. 언약 깨를 맨 제사장 발이 잠기니까 역사. When the priests that were carrying the uh, Ark of the Covenant 자, stepped in, the Jordan split. And so what we realize from this is when the, God, uh, the plan of God is true, enter. If it's, not, if it's not the plan of God, you can't do anything. But if it is the plan of God, then with assurance, go forward. And so when the priest's foot entered, The Jordan, it split. And in Joshua chapter six, verse one to twenty, those who had the Ark of the Covenant, they stood in the front. So called the Jericho. So that means go to the place where the word of God is being fulfilled, and that's what we need to do. So if you're always enjoying this prayer, you can easily see the plan of God. So if you're not receiving answers, there is God's very important thing hidden within that. You are the main figures of this age. You must never lose hold of this and take this prayer with you. Church members, this prayer must never lose hold of this and take this prayer with you. You need to help believers so that they enjoy this strength in their daily life. You need to help believers so that they have this strength as they come to church. You need to help them so that they can face crisis, problem, and hardships. You need to help them so that they can face crisis, problem, and hardships. You need to help them so that they can face crisis, problem, and hardships. You need to help them so that they can face crisis, problem, and hardships. You need to help them so that they can face crisis, problem, and hardships. You need to help them so that they can face crisis, problem, and hardships. I bless you in the name of Jesus Christ. You gave great strength today. I bless you in the name of Jesus Christ. You gave great strength through today's prayer. Let us pray. We thank you for giving us the mystery of Christ, who is the King above all kings. Allows to be the spiritual summit that enjoys the five powers. Always enjoy the peace of God. Allows to always enjoy the place of peace. 참 평안함으로 세계 살리는 여정을 가게 해 주옵소서. And with true peace, allows to walk the journey of saving the world. 주 예수 그리스도 이름으로 기도하옵나이다. We pray in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen.